Want to stop using iCloud and remove it from your iOS device? There are a couple different ways to do this, so we're here to show you how it's done. I'm Jessica from techboomers.com. In this video, I'll be showing you how to delete iCloud from your iOS devices, including iPhone, iPad, and iPod Touch. Now let's get started. Since iCloud is linked to your Apple ID account, you'll need to remove your Apple ID account from your device in order to delete iCloud. The first method we'll be showing you for how to do this is through your computer's web browser. This method is the most quick and convenient because you can remove your Apple ID from multiple devices in the same place. If you prefer, you can also remove your Apple ID from your iOS device through your iOS settings. Skip ahead to the time listed on your screen if you'd like to use that method. To begin the first method, open your preferred browser and go to appleid.apple.com. Enter your email address and password to sign in. Now, scroll down to your list of devices. Click on a device to view details about it. You'll see a small window pop up below. Click Remove to sign out of your Apple ID account on that device and remove iCloud data. To confirm, click Remove this iPhone. Repeat these steps to remove any other devices you no longer want to use iCloud on. The other way you can delete iCloud from your devices is through the settings on your iOS device. To begin, tap Settings on your home screen. Then tap your name at the top. Scroll down to see a list of devices signed into your Apple ID account. Tap a device's name to see details. At the bottom, tap Remove from Account. To confirm, tap Remove. Repeat these steps to remove your Apple ID from your other devices. If you only want to remove your Apple ID from your iOS device and not from any other Apple devices you have, you can simply sign out. To do this, open your settings and tap your name. Then, scroll to the bottom and tap Sign Out. You'll be prompted to turn off Find My iPhone, since this tracking feature is also linked to your Apple ID. Enter your Apple ID password, then tap Turn Off. Some important data like contacts and calendars may be stored in iCloud instead of on your device. If you want to keep this data on your device rather than removing it along with your Apple ID account, tap the switch beside what you'd like to keep. When the switch turns from white to green, that information will be kept. When you're ready, tap Sign Out at the top. Finally, tap Sign Out to confirm. If you're looking to permanently delete your Apple ID and iCloud account altogether, you'll need to contact Apple Support and ask them to erase the account for you. To get in touch with Apple Support, go to getsupport.apple.com. That's everything you need to know about deleting iCloud from your iOS devices. Thanks for watching. If you found this video helpful, we'd love it if you'd hit the thumbs up button below. Check out techboomers.com for over 100 free courses on all of today's most popular websites and apps.